Hello guys from Federico Town. Today I'm going to talk about the Miami Open final between Carlos Alcaraz and Casper Ruud. The, this was the first final for both of the, of the players. Well, we can start off uh, with the Spaniard who wins his first Masters 1000 in Miami at only 18 years of age. I mean, this player, uh, I said it also last year, he's incredible. He's a phenom. And he beats the Norwegian Kasper Ruud 7-5, 6-4 in a great final. I mean, uh, what level of tennis? Incredible. Also, he was losing in the first set. He came back. He showed his mental strength again. And let's underline what a what a week for Carlos Alcaraz. It's the well, it's the biggest title of his career so far. And now he climbed thanks to this win in Miami to the 11th position. So he surpassed even Sinner in the ATP rankings. And of course, he's only uh, one ranking away from world number 10. Well, I said it also last year, he's going to be a top 10 very soon. His progression uh, was very fast and uh, I hope he's going to do very well. He's going to win many more titles. I think he can win uh, a lot of Grand Slams. He can also qualify for the ATP World Tour Finals for next year. I mean, he has all the qualities. He has a lot of talent. I like also his composure, his attitude on court. Uh, he's a really an example also for other players that will come. And this Miami tournament has left us with many surprises. Uh, I knew that Alcaraz was going to get the win against a great player like Casper uh, Ruud, who now is world number seven. And Casper uh, Ruud will have also many more chances to win a big title in the future. Guys, that's it for today. If you like the channel, don't hesitate to subscribe and to leave a like. And see you next time. Bye.